Hey everyone, um, I have my lunch cooking for the kiddos and um, since so many of you have asked and been um, like shocked by the fact that the new cooking blender can make peanut butter, um, I figured I'll come on here and show you guys again. I know I did a video of this before but it's so incredible to see it in action. So you can make your own kind of nut butter, any kind of nut butter, um, almond butter, cashew, hold on we have to measure that first. So just so you don't think I'm trying to pull the wool over your I'm eyes, I figure we'll measure it and everything right here. The only ingredient, hold on, you can pour this in there, okay? The only ingredient in this is peanuts. Um, and it, Well, it says a half, half a teaspoon of salt, but um, I'm using honey roasted peanuts, so because this is, I've made it with this like so many times that look, my gigantic container is empty, almost. There's like a couple in there. So that's it. Watch this. We pour it in. Okay, and speaking of your mind being blown, I have to tell you this too. Don't push a button yet. Don't push a button yet. Can I um, just a minute. Not yet. Not yet. Um, I just found out too that I, many people are so much smarter than me and like figure these things out on their own, but I never would have figured this out. Not yet, guys. You can make powdered sugar in this thing. If you're baking and you find that like you're out of powdered sugar, which I do all the time because I'm like, oh shoot, I need powdered sugar for this. Do I have any? Oh no, I don't. You can make powdered sugar in it. The same setting that makes the peanut butter will grind your regular sugar into powdered sugar for you. Careful, guys. It's amazing. So, now, these guys are getting a little nuts here, so we're going to move along. We're going to turn it on, and it's going to get loud. So, you guys ready? Yeah. What do we... Oh, okay, hold on. Stay down. Stay down. We got the lid on. We're going to turn it to the grind setting. Um, I think that's it. We have to turn, it's going to get loud right here. We're going to turn to the grind setting and we push start. Ready? It's going to get loud. That's it. It's going to make peanut butter for us in two minutes and 20 seconds. It's unbelievable. <laughs> now this is the tamper that we're going to use to kind of see like, whoops, oh, hold on, now we're going to do this. Oops, sorry about that. We need to just tamp it down a little bit, and that's normal. Like, they, you're supposed to do that. Hold on. I messed it up by taking the, the lid off. Oh, that's a cool safety feature we just found out, though. It'll automatically shut off if you take the lid off. Now we're just going to push the sides down with the tamper. Get it moving again. And that's it. We're pushing the sides down and giving it a little tamp, tamping, little tamping action here. Oh, Johanna. You just shut it off, babes. What are you doing? All right, I'm sorry. We gotta start this again. Don't touch that. That shuts it off all the way. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> Cooking with kids, and that's what happens sometimes. Oh my gosh. Okay, now we're gonna have to push it down again. Oh, here it goes. There it goes. Check it out. There it goes. <laughs> Don't touch this button again because you shut it off. And we're trying to make peanut butter to show all our friends. Say hi friends, we're making peanut butter. Hi friends. So, um, you can see it's starting to, no, 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 no. You can see it's starting to get smoother. Let me take that off, I'm gonna give it, I think it's pretty good, but I'm just gonna tamp it a little bit more. Shutting it off, thank you. 
I'm going to unplug it because, you know, she'll likely push the button again here. But seriously, you guys saw that. It was like, what? It, it was like two minutes. And look at that. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to eat that. You want a bite? And like I said, you can use any kind of, any kind of nut. Okay, that's... <laughs> There you go. Hold on. Right in your mouth. There you go. This would make a nice glaze on like a chocolate cake. Oh, Ellie has your shoes on. Oh my gosh. Here you go. Oh, it's so good. Isn't No, no, you can't double dip. You have a little cold. No double dipping. You have a cold. I'm going to move this because she's got a cold and we can't have double dipping with that. So I wanted to come on and show you guys that and let you know about the powdered sugar because like I said, this totally just blows my mind that these things are possible with this thing. And in, now when I'm done with this, I'm going to pour this into little containers so we can have sam peanut butter and jelly sandwiches tomorrow or whenever. And then I'm going to put the water in it up to, uh, what is it, three cups. I'm going to add, get out of here. <laughs> get it, no, no double dipping. You guys are sick. You have little colds. I'm going to add um, water up to three cups. I'm going to add one drop of dish soap. I'm going to put it right back on here and I'm going to turn it to the heated wash setting and it's going to wash it for me. <laughs> it just blows my mind, right? So, now the last thing I'll say about this is that um, I have a couple spots left in November for you to host a party and get it at 60% off. And I would love to help you do that because everybody should have one of these in their house. It's, I mean, you can do anything in it. You know, the smoothie bowls, um, your regular smoothies, you can make ice cream in it. Yeah, yeah. Soup. Oh, I forgot to say the soups, of course. Um, Haracha, I, I'm sorry, I don't even know what that is, but <laughs> you can make that in it. <laughs> you can make, if you have gluten issues, you can make your own homemade ground, um, like flour or whatever, with whatever product you use for that. Um, this, this roasted pepper, red pepper and walnut dip is delicious. The hummus in here is delicious. All the soups you can make in it, of course. Um, all right, so that's it, guys. I hope you have a great day. And let me know if you want, if you're ready to uh, get yours at 60% off. It's like, it ends up being like $130, I think, with the 60% off. So, and I would love to help you do that. Bye, everyone.